Executive Chairman of Ernst & Young Caribbean, Wei George, says the property tax introduced by the government meets the international benchmarks, and he's of the view that if people see they are getting value for money, they'll eventually have no problem with it. It was one of the talking points during Finance Minister Colin Membert's five-hour-long budget presentation on Monday. But George is weighing in on the problems faced on the crime front. National security is a foundational element in the state's right to tax. We do ourselves a disservice in focusing on the price of crime to business. What price can you place on the impact of crime on the national psyche? The anxiety of citizens and the migration of skilled young people. And I see that. The answer is obvious. There can be no prosperity without security. Economist Dr. Marlene Atz concurs. As she mentions, the many plans in various areas, including diversification and tourism, featured in the budget. While she states that financial resources are important, as it pertains to crime, she points to other elements that must be worked out. We need to look at both the internal processes of our national security architecture and also the wider national ecosystems that contribute to our current crime situation. It must not be lost on any one of us in this room or on the government, and I'm sure it's not lost on them, that we have a youth unemployment challenge and the players in the criminal enterprise also are our youth. On another note, while George believes the 2025 fiscal plan served to give hope for the future and outline plans on matters such as diversification, he says there were gaps, especially as it relates to what he calls the hard issues. How do we wean and reskill the population from reliance on government employment? How do we enhance public sector efficiency? How do we ensure value for money? How do we better target subsidies and avoid wasteful and unaffordable expenditure? How do we increase business facilitation and public sector, private sector cooperation? How do we nurture entrepreneurship? Minister of Finance, Colin Member, says the respective ministers will expand on the plans raised during his presentation under their ministries. Alicia Boucher, TV6 News.